Hi friends, what's this entry box? I'm entering in lowercase all this text. Welcome to plus to net and this is changing all the entries to uppercase as I am typing. We'll learn how to do this. This is our blank template or window. We, to this we'll add our components. Let's just see how this looks. So it is here it is. So to this first we'll start with a declaring a string variable. Sorry it is lowercase str1 equal to tk dot string var. So I, this string var I will connect it to a entry box or e1. e1 is my entry box equal to tk dot entry now where it what it is my underscore w is my parent window i declared it at line number two you can see here so this parent window i am using it now i'll say text variable text variable equal to now this i'll connecting it to str1 so then slightly bigger font i am using 26 now width also equal to let's say 30 now next line I am just coming I am giving a slight background color I am giving my entry box now I will press this entry box to you know my grid so it's a grid for the first element this is so I will give row equal to 0 and column equal to 0 now I am not flushing with top edge so pad y equal to 20 and pad x equal to 10 so I'm maintaining a left edge 10 gap and from the top 20 gap. Now the most important thing is here it is. Now this a string variable which is connected to my entry box. It will be holding the data whatever I add to the my entry box. Now it has a, a trace method. In that trace method, trace I will use w. w means whenever this variable is changed then this will trigger the callback so other options are I can destroy it or when it is created I am using whenever it is changed so whenever that means whenever I am adding a data or removing whatever I if I am entering any data this this particular method will call this uh, function so my upper what is my upper is my function which I have not yet declared so let's me just declare my function here define my upper now inside this i will write our args all the arguments what are the variables let it go to inside this all i am putting a star there so everything will go there now only one liner i will write it note that this str1 which is a string variable here it is line number seven we have declared it now this string variable uh, to read the data whatever the string variable contains that means whatever I entered in the entry box I have to use the get method and similarly to set the value I have to use set method or to write something to the text variable so for that these two I will use so let's first str1.get that means I am reading the value then because it's a string I can use a upper upper means it will just whatever the uh, it will reads make it uppercase now this one in particular str1 dot set means i am set this value first this one str1 dot this will read whatever the value is entered in the entry box convert it to uppercase then set the same value to str1 set so that's all so this will whatever i enter it even if it's a lowercase or a uppercase also it will convert it to uppercase now this particular trace method this one will trigger every every character i enter this will trigger this particular function let me just save it and run once so here all i am entering is in lowercase welcome to plus to net.com so whatever i am entering in whatever even if i enter in uppercase also it will remain in uppercase if i am entering in lowercase it will convert it to uppercase let's try the reverse way so whatever we enter from a uppercase to lowercase will change now for that i am just commenting this line copying this paste it here and just change this to upper to lower Okay, now I will enter all the uh, uppercase letters so automatically it will come to lowercase. Let's just see this. We are running this now. I have my caps lock is on now. 
now i am saying welcome whenever i am entering all upper case letters it's just changing it to immediately to lower case that's all this was a question asked by mr anand so this is a simple 10 lines of code you can easily and further change it also you want to improve it and if you have any doubt suggestion or questions uh, then post it in the comment section we'll definitely respond it and we love your questions also and i will request you please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you'll be notified as and when we post new new videos we frequently do that also please share this with your friends and thank you for watching